talent you have naturally. Skill is only developed by hours and hours and hours of beating on your craft. If, if people want to buy Modern Warfare or Halo Reach, that's fine because I think those games are shit. And that's, if that's what people want, then people don't want the games that I make because I don't make shit games. What I discovered, guys, that if what I say and what I do are congruent, then I have a better chance of being successful. The craziest thing. It's the craziest thing. I learned that, Eric, if you say this and you do it, wow, success. Some things in life you don't get, you gotta go take it. Success will not come to you. Some things you gotta take by force or you'll never have them. They not just, and nobody's gonna knock. Federal Express, listen to me. You will not be a multimillionaire. Federal Express will knock, knock on your door. Can you sign here, please? I have multi-millions for you. Just sign, that's it. There's no easy way around it. No matter how talented you are, your talent is going to fail you if you're not skilled. You know, if you don't study, if you don't work uh, really hard and dedicate yourself to being better every single day, mm -hmm. you'll never be able to communicate with, with people, with your artistry, the, the way that you want. You have to just start making stuff. And so there are a lot of opportunities now, especially like with the indie scene. Uh, you could do independent works on your own. There's modding groups where you could take a game, like uh, an established game, and like make a new level for it. So getting that kind of stuff on your portfolio right off the bat, like I wish I had started doing that in high school. Don't let what ifs get in your way. Just do. Just do something. Anything. And it might suck, but you'll learn something, and that's fine. Yeah, look at what other people have done, look at tutorials, look at code and just play with the code. And then once you're comfortable with it, don't try to make your biggest game. Just make a small game and actually finish it. Yeah, start small too. Uh, a lot of people want to do a lot of great things with games. And uh, they don't realize exactly how many different wheels are turning behind the scenes of a game. I want to talk to those of you in September and you, you know we're close to finishing your goal. You know we're close to making your dreams become a reality. You're still talking about it, or you've been doing it, but you, you haven't given it 120%. Like, you, you, you don't want it as bad as you want to breathe. So I want to talk to y'all. I do want you to know this, that it's not too late. You don't try to build a wall. You don't set out to build a wall. You don't say, I want to be, build the biggest, baddest, greatest wall that's ever been built. You don't start there. You say, I'm going to lay this brick as perfectly as a brick can be laid. Yeah. And you do that every single day. And soon you have a wall. And soon you have a wall.